All right, hey there, guys. It's Justin. Welcome back to CJ Farms. So what we got going on today is, uh, as you saw yesterday, well, in yesterday's part of the video, uh, I had to vacuum out the inside and kind of clean up inside of the cab. And today what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be getting the pressure washer and pressure washing the exterior. And then on the interior here, I got to get some cleaning supplies and clean up the inside. And then we're going to pop the hood and clean out the filters and whatnot under the hood because today is June, I think, 12th. And I think we plan on cutting hay uh, starting next week. So we're getting things lined up and ready to roll. So without further ado, let's get into the video.
All right, you guys, I'm standing in the shop because we just had a storm roll through and it's still a little bit windy, but as you can see, we got the baler all sitting out here. We were getting it all serviced up. We got the Coyote 9020 right here. And then the mower is like over here and my rake is still sitting over there, but got the tractor service, uh, hydraulic fluid, oil, all that good stuff. We got the mower serviced. Um, later on this season, we're gonna have to flip around the knives because some of them are pretty bad, but as of right now, they're still gonna be able to cut down the power station field, which I don't know if I'm gonna be able to film that or uh, what the story is, but um, basically, Dad's gonna cut it tomorrow, which is Friday, which is when this video is coming out. And uh, depending on how far he gets, depends on if I'm gonna be able to film any of it or not. I've got some stuff going on, so. Then, um, the rake obviously doesn't really need any maintenance. I didn't tear up any uh, teeth on it. I didn't take any of the wheels off on accident, none of that good stuff. Baylor just, um, you know, needs its maintenance, it's greasing, it's uh, just looked over, making sure everything's gonna still run properly. Um, we have a roll of net wrap for it. It's not a full one. We are gonna need to get a full roll, but, um, not right now, it's not really a concern. So, yeah, with that, you guys, uh, please like, please subscribe. I've got some uh, content that's gonna be coming out um, about the heifers that we brought home. And uh, we actually went and put cedars in them to get them all cycling into heat at the same time so we can go ahead and AI them. Uh, we ran through like 72 cows, I think. Uh, we had some minis that we wanna AI the 12 heifers that we held over and the 47 that dad bought, um, they're all getting AI'd, so I'll have a little bit more on that um, as the weeks go on uh, in between haying and stuff. So, uh, yeah, as for now, please like, please subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.